Hey everyone, welcome to week 10. 10 weeks pregnant, yay! That is in the double digits. That's so cool, you know? 10 weeks, which means that we are a quarter of the way through the pregnancy, which is really cool to look at that way. Um, so yeah, 10 weeks. Um, this past week has been great. It, it's pretty much the same as last week. Um, I've been feeling good. Um, no morning sickness, no stomach feeling funny, um, nothing. I've, I'm, I'm good. Um, still full breast, um, maybe tender at times. Um, still hungry, of course. That will continue. Growing baby. Um, yeah, As I'm so tired at times, but uh, but I feel like I might be getting a little bit of energy back, which is really cool. Um, so uh, that's it as far as symptoms go. I really don't have much else to say. So I'll just go ahead and go into our first prenatal appointment that we had on Wednesday. It was really, really neat um, meeting the OB and everything, and he ended up being awesome. We loved him, so we're really excited um, about him and all the visits, you know, and him delivering our baby and all that kind of stuff. Um, he's really big into diet and nutrition and all that kind of stuff, so he talked to us quite a while about, you know, things to eat throughout the day and things that, you know, are good for you, blah, blah, blah. So that was really cool and informational. Um, he was very personable. I just, I really liked him. But anyways, um, he asked us questions about our health history and our family's health history and all that kind of stuff. And um, we didn't do an ultrasound. He um, he was like, well, well, let's try the Doppler and see if we can hear the heartbeat. At that appointment, I was nine weeks and three days, I believe. Um, and usually you start hearing the heartbeat on the Doppler around 10 weeks. Um, but he was like, we'll go ahead and try it. You're more on the thin side. And when that's the case, you can sometimes hear it a little bit early. So we tried it and we heard the heartbeat. It was the most amazing Thing. And it, like just a whole different experience in life. It, it was emotional and exciting. It was, it was just really cool. Um, and my husband was with me, so he got to hear it too. And that was, he really liked it. I will go back for my first trimester screenings. Um, I think as of right now, it will be March 2nd. Um, and I will just be 12 weeks and couple days then. So I have that. And then on that Friday, March 4th is when I have my 12 week prenatal appointment with my doctor. Um, so yeah, um, he said, you know, with him being big into diet and nutrition, he's, um, you know, big into exercising and staying fit and healthy during pregnancy. So he said, you know, I want you to, you know, try, it's good to exercise in a minimum of three times a week, which I need to work on. I was in the, you know, routine of it, of doing it when we were, um, you know, trying to conceive. And then towards the end of that, like I just got off. I don't know. I just, you know, you're in that blah mood and you're on the holidays and all that kind of stuff. So, um, and then once I got pregnant, I've just been so tired where I can't do anything. And so now that I've gotten a little bit of energy back, I started my workouts and I've done a couple so far. I want to do, try to do at least do a minimum of three, um, three times a week and, um, mainly just do some cardio. He said cardio is really good, but don't get your heart rate above 140 because that's going to take away from the baby. You already have increased blood flow, all that kind of stuff. And I will say the first day when I got on the elliptical, at the gym, I, you know, put my hands on the thing and got my heart rate. And it was in like 160s. I was like, oh gosh. And so I like slowed down a little bit. It's just habit for me to just get on there and get going. So I had to take it easy, which was kind of weird and took some getting used to. Um, but yeah, um, did about 45 minutes of that and 
So just as long as I get some cardio in and try to keep my heart rate below 140, and I'll try to vary it up, maybe do the elliptical, maybe um, you know more of a power walk on the treadmill or do the, um, the bike or um, where my husband and I, once it starts getting warmer out, we will go walking in the evenings and everything. So, um, but another thing that I'm going to start doing is prenatal yoga. And that will help with relaxation, which is good. Um, it'll help, you know, with stretching and strengthening the muscles and everything that's good to, you know, keep your baby healthy and prepare your body for, um, for delivery. So I'm really, really excited about that. I purchased a prenatal yoga DVD. It's the um, Prenatal Yoga by Shiva Ray. And I did some research online, and this one seemed to be the most popular one. And when I was at Target the other day, it was actually on sale. So I got it for $10 at Target. And um, I did it the first time today, which was really nice. I went and did my workout at the gym this morning, and then came back and did the yoga. And I liked it. It's a 50 minute, it starts with, you know, a warm up, and then you go into your um, standing poses, you know, floor poses, and then you do like a relaxation technique at the end. So it was really neat. I felt really good, relaxed, um, just really just, re I don't know, revived? I don't know. It's, it was a good feeling. And so I'm really glad to um, get started on that, just to feel better. Um, and it is, it looks easy, but it's a little harder than it looks. So, um, so yeah, that's that. And, um, you know, that's one thing that I bought this week. Another thing is just, um, just a little solid gray onesie from Target that was on clearance because I do, um, I make little onesies and stuff, you know, with the fabric and then stitching around it. Um, and so I'll just use that to make a little onesie, you know, put some, you know, decorative fabric, you know, make a tie for boy or flower for girl, you know, all that kind of stuff. So, um, I guess that's all that I have to say for 10 weeks. You know, not much. It was great. We had a great prenatal appointment. I really like my OB. Um, yeah, so I guess that's it. We'll do the belly shot and measurement and then we'll be finished. Okay, so here we are for the belly shot, and weight was up to um, from last week, so I think that puts me a total of up four, you know, since becoming pregnant, so I don't know, but we'll do measurement and show you the belly. All right, so front, side, Kind of cutting it off down there. Maybe not. Side. So belly, I'd say that we're at 32 inches. So belly at 32 inches for 10 weeks. So we'll see you guys next week for 11 weeks pregnant. Bye guys.